The race for the White House will most certainly run through Metro Atlanta, and not only because Metro Atlanta will host the fifth Democratic presidential debate next month, that location is still in the air. But this could be yet another signal that Georgia could be in play for the, two the uh, 2020 race. After last voting for a Democratic president some 27 years ago. 11 Lives Doug Richards digs into how both parties say they are going to benefit from this debate. Doug? Well, Cheryl, neither political party has scheduled a primary season presidential debate in Georgia in 27 years. Georgia's sudden emergence as a debate venue this year is no coincidence. For Georgia Democrats, the presence of Elizabeth Warren, Joe Biden, and other hopefuls could fuel a party trying to muscle up its state apparatus. And it is my hope that we bring people into the fold of the party who have never been engaged before. Democrats last hosted a presidential debate in 1992. That's also the last year a Democrat won a presidential election in Georgia. Based on elections for governor, Georgia hasn't been a blue state since 1998. Georgia turned purple in 2002 and bright red four years later. Since then, it stayed reddish but turned purple again last year when Republican Brian Kemp barely won the governor's seat. That turned Georgia into a political battleground. There are a lot of national eyeballs on Georgia. We are going to get attention like we have not had in decades and perhaps ever, probably since Jimmy Carter was a candidate for president. And next year, Democrats have their sights on the congressional seat, now held by Republican Rob Woodall, the U.S. Senate seat, held by Republican David Perdue, and the seat soon to be vacated by Republican Senator Johnny Isaacson. Republicans are hoping a Democratic presidential debate in Georgia jolts the GOP. The Democrats are right. This is competitive here. Republicans can and should still win here, but we have to fight door to door. You cannot just win statewide here by having an R behind your name. The Democrats know it. Republicans better realize it. So where will it be held? That's still unclear. The last one 27 years ago was held at the Carter Center. Might be someplace bigger this time, might be someplace more suburban. That's where Democrats are making their biggest gains in Georgia. But the Democrats say they are still browsing, Jeff. Yeah, there was a vice presidential debate in 1992 at the first center on the t uh, campus of Georgia Tech. We will continue to post updates on the upcoming debate on 11alive.com. As soon as we know the location, we will alert you on the 11alive app.